binary file operation in python agenda of this video understanding binary file operation understanding pickle module dump function and load function and some programs on binary file operation python offers a module for this purpose which is called or known as pickle module with the algorithms of the pickle module we can serialize and deserialize python objects structure pickling denotes or means the process which converts a python object into a byte structure stream that is bytes and unpickling on the other hand is the inverse of operation of pickling it again converts the byte streams to the object we call pickling and un unpickling it is also known as serialization or flattening a data structure an object can be dumped that is stored using the dump method of the pickle module pickle dot that's object uh, syntax is pickle dot object objects which have been dumped to a file with a pickle mon dump dot dump functions can be reread into a program by using the method pickle so its syntax is a uh, file uh, function is load that file inside that you have to give the file name pickle load recognizes automatically which format the file is and it extracts some example programs now understand the dump function of pickle module with this example program so for binary operation in a file we have to write or we have to use the pickle module so this uh, program through this program i want to demonstrate the how the dump function works so first uh, import the pickle module and then uh, there are some values uh, cities in a list and uh, this is the file handler and using open function one one file file uh, <coughs> we are opening that is the binary dot data and that is the mode for the binary file write operation bw and this is the uh, function dump function and uh, pickle is the module name so pickle dot dump module name dot dump and then uh, we have to give the two parameter two parameters are used there one is the cities and the file handler name so using this uh, <coughs> all the contents which is stored in the binary Uh, which is stored in the cities and uh, that will be stored in the binary one dot data and last statement is the close close the period. now <coughs> check this program so all the things is written in the <coughs> file you can <coughs> you can check it uh, the file name is the binary dot 
file name is binary one dot date dot data now open this you can see the things there binary dot data now you can understand through this example what is the difference between text files and so this files cannot be opened and if it uh, we will try to open this then we will get the <coughs> things uh, not in a proper way so <coughs> the <coughs> things <coughs> have to check it uh, where it is stored actually first uh, check it where the final file is stored so file is stored in binary one dot data so this file is the path is that windows is and then python so now you can see that what are the contents how the contents are stored there now go to the directory python directory and check the things there how the stores information is stores the text files we can open easily using this <coughs> notepad so in the python directory there is this is the file binary one dot data you can check that how it is stored there using notepad okay now you can see that these are the contents stored there so it is in the coded format so this is the different between between <coughs> the text files and the binary files binary files the informations are not not stored as it was at a, as it is stored but it is stored in the co <coughs> coded format so in this through this example so <coughs> practically we got the <coughs> knowledge that uh, how the difference between the text files and the binary files text files everything is stored in the textual format so you can see it you can modify and you can do anything but in the binary file the <coughs> in the binary file format you have to require the proper uh, proper <coughs> application to open that so now now use the load function for the <coughs> uh, <coughs> i have uh, one example program for that that is the binary 2.py in this example program the <coughs> the demonstration related to the how you can use the load function so through the load function again the <coughs> whatever is stored in the form of bytes uh, <coughs> that is again uh, <coughs> read by the load function and it will be displayed at as it was it is stored there so it is it will be displayed in the textual format and we can uh, <coughs> read these things so now we can see this program run the module now you can see that whatever the contents is stored in the file and that is the <coughs> binary one dot that those things are uh, you can see here so uh, the difference between the text file and uh, <laughs> binary file is clear that in the binary files it is required that uh, it can be uh, opened in that <coughs> uh, <coughs> that text files can be opened anyway in the notepad but binary file is required that a particular application is required or load function is required to read the contents now after <coughs> getting knowledge of these uh, two functions that is the dump and load function dump function is used to write the things and load function is used to now understand this uh, <coughs> program this program is to <coughs> read a binary file student dot dat and its a structure is like the first element is admission number then name and then percentage and we have to write a function count record in python that would read the contents of the file student dot that and display the details of those students whose percentage is above 75 percent so <coughs> the program uh, is like that so first we have to import the pickle model and then then 
<coughs> the function starts define count record this is the <coughs> the statements opens the file for the read mode and binary file and uh, this is the variable for counting the number of records which has the greater than 75 marks and this is inside the try and accept block so the this this this, this is the loop which is <coughs> reading uh, which reads the whole file and each and every record is stored through the pickle load and the file through the file this file pointer and student data all the each and every records is stored there <coughs> one by one in a record and then uh, check the second element that is the percentage of that list it is stored in the form of list record is stored in the form of list and second element is the uh, percentage element so second element is compared with the uh, 75% greater than 75% or not if it is then it prints record and count record so already there is a file a student dot data and <coughs> it has some records so now we have to run the module now these are the records so <coughs> which uh, <coughs> is having more than uh, 75 marks so <coughs> this is the one of the uh, Now this is the next uh, program, demonstration program and the, in this program uh, uh, the program is uh, to write a function to search and display the details of a student whose roll number is 1005 from the binary file student.data having a structure, roll number, name, class and fees. Now uh, the program is uh, <coughs> here uh, <coughs> written already. So import uh, the pickle module first import then define the function search and then uh, uh, open the function student dot uh, data for uh, read uh, reading mode for the binary rv and uh, inside the try and accept <coughs> there uh, we have uh, running the <coughs> we are running the um, one uh, loop loop is there uh, the loop this loop will uh, ch uh, read all each and every record from that file this student dot print and uh, the first value of that record is zero that is the uh, roll number so it will check whether that roll number is one zero zero five if that roll number is zero zero then it will print and then if it is not then it will pass and the end the it is the <coughs> end of the program closing and now <coughs> next is the uh, main program that is the calling the program so run this program now you can see that there is one record uh, in that student dot data uh, which uh, consists of 1005 as a roll number so thank you for watching <coughs> the video